<laughs> now who's going to take charge of these chickens while I'm gone? Right here! Not so fast, Peggy. Anybody else want the job? <laughs> the pig? He's only standing there because he's too lazy to walk away. Pig, do you want to be in charge of the chickens? I never seen him so excited. You can't both be in charge. So let's have an election. But isn't an election where people choose who they want to be in charge by voting? People or chickens? <laughs> chickens, who'd you rather have in charge? Peg or the pig? Just sit by either picture to vote for who you want. One, two, three, four votes for me. One, two, three, four, five for the pig. Four is less than five, so the pig is winning. Come on, chickens, vote for me. Why are they just sitting there? Oh, the chickens always take their time deciding who to vote for. They've had elections before. Check out some of their past leaders. They got Ramon. But they've always wanted to elect someone who lives on the farm. The pig lives on the farm, so he has a way better chance of winning. We've got a really big problem. But I'm not giving up. Chicken, this sign means more than. And if you vote for me instead of the pig, that's exactly what you'll get. That's the way we do. So be sure then vote for more than vote for pig. If he's offering two snacks, I'll offer seven. If he offers ten, then I'll offer eleven. Just ask your fellow chick. It's plain arithmetic. So be sure then vote for more than vote for pig. Vote for pig. Woo! Vote for pig. So be sure then vote for more than